Windows Update Service is one of the most complex systems present on your Windows device. It requires some essential services to function properly to work. When one of these services, Background Intelligence Transfer Services or BITS fails, the NetHelp MS2182 error message shows up on the user's screen. If you are facing this issue, enact these quick fixes on your system to solve the problem quickly. Run the BITS troubleshooter. At first, press the Windows key plus R keys together. Then, type Control in the run and hit Enter to open the control panel. Once you are in the control panel, tap on the view by, drop down and choose the small icons option. You will see all the control panel items. Tap on the troubleshooting. Tap on view all. On the left hand side. Next, click on the background intelligent transfer service troubleshooter. Now, tap on Advanced. Next, check the Apply Repairs Automatically box. Then, tap on Next. Let Windows find out the issue and fix it for you. After applying this fix, we recommend you restart the machine once. Then, try to run the Windows update again. Restart the bits. If troubleshooting doesn't sort things out, try directly restarting the bits from services. At first, press the Windows key and type services. Then, tap on the services to open it. When the services window opens up, Scroll down to the Background Intelligent Transfer Service. Just double-click on the service to open it. Set the startup type to Manual Mode. Tap on Start to start the service. Finally, tap on Apply and OK to save these changes. After altering the bits, close the services. Check whether this works out. Run the update troubleshooter. Try running the update troubleshooter on your system. At first, press the Windows key plus I keys together. Then, tap on the settings and press update and security. Next, click on troubleshoot. Additional troubleshooters. Next, under Get Up and Running, select Windows Update and run the troubleshooter. Follow the on-screen instructions to fix the Windows Update. Reset the store cache. Resetting the store cache should fix the issue. Press Reset. This way, you can reset the store cache on your system. Now, try to update your system again. Start Stop the Windows Update Components. If the Windows Update components are not working well, this fix should help. At first, open command prompt as admin. Just copy paste these four commands one by one and hit enter to execute these sequentially. This will temporarily pause these four services. Now, 
paste this command and hit enter to rename the folders. Type these commands one at a time and press enter. This will start the paused services again on your system. After executing all the above mentioned commands, close the command prompt. Try to update your system once again.